I said, if they still had cab over, how many people would still have got their CDL? And they come out with a damn 2025 Tesla damn truck with it. That's a cab over. None. None. <laughs> None. No, no, we we talk about no, we 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 not talking about a luxury cab over. We not talking about a cab over with with a microwave air ride. No, we talking about a cab over where the motherfucking bunk is right behind the fucking seat, and you and you sleeping on a motherfucking thin ass mattress. No, no air ride, no power steering, no none of that shit. How many of y'all motherfuckers would be in this industry if it's still, if if it was still being cab overs? None. Especially oh. none of you. No, I, I take that back. None of the new jacks will be in this industry, but the but it will go to show you who love doing this shit versus who's doing this shit for the money. Because every time I turn around, every time I hear, oh, uh. I'm out here for the money. It's time to get the money. It's time to get the bag. It's time to get the, it's time to grind for the money. I'm all about the money. Money, money, money. But is is that it though, bro? That it? Yeah, that's the only reason why I'm out here. I ain't coming out here for nothing else but the money. See, back then, old schoolers wasn't talking about how much money they was making. Old schoolers wasn't talking about how much money could be made. They knew how much money that 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 could be made back in the day. They never talked about it. What they talked about, they talked about the convoy. Where there'd be a line of truckers going up and down these highways. What they talked about, they talked about when one of their own is broke down on the side and they'll get on the CB, hey, good buddy, you you okay back there, good buddy? You need me to g- grab something for you? You need 5-0? You need something to drink? They, they wasn't talking about no money. They wasn't talking about they, they wasn't talking about how much money they was getting. They wasn't talking about, oh, it's it, when they wake up in the morning, it's time to get to the bag. They wasn't talking about that shit. When they when they got up in the morning back in the day, they got up in the morning, they, they pre-tripped and trip planned. And, and, and figured out how many motherfucking books they're going to use for the day. They ain't talked about no money. It wasn't it was it wasn't about money a long time ago. But now it is though, because you got all of these, you got all these so-called gurus, all these fake motherfuckers out here that's selling you fucking wolf tickets every day. Oh, give me five hundred dollars, give me fourteen hundred dollars, and I can show you how to run a successful trucking business. But they don't have a fucking successful trucking business, bro. How are you going to teach me something that you don't have? In, in, cash out me five hundred dollars so I can give you a thirty minute, a thirty minute consultation. Uh, so what are you at? So what are you looking for? Uh, I'm I'm looking for a good uh, trucking job. Uh, I'm I'm looking for where I can make uh, some money. Oh, okay, okay. Um. Well, I got advice for you. Wait, that's that's it? I'm giving you $500 for advice? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, Prime. You know Prime. Prime is the best place to go. Prime. Nigga. You charge me $500 just to say that just go over to Prime? And I could have found all that shit myself on, 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 on YouTube. Oh, fuck out of here. But yeah, man, like, 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 like I said, two hundred, five hundred dollars for knowledge. Yeah, 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 yeah. 
in, in, in your knowledge, your your knowledge reigns as far as the uh, as far as the internet. Oh wait 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 though, you mean to tell me I couldn't I couldn't figure that shit on by myself though? I had to call you, bro. Bro, I I had to give you two hundred dollars for you to just tell me to go to JB Hunt to do local. And all I had to do was just go on the internet, Indeed, YouTube, Glassdoor, Craigslist. See the problem with the, the, the problem with these with these motherfuckers I hear over here saying, well, if you can do it, I can if I can do it, you can do it too, type mentality. The problem is, is that you need you you not telling me how you got there. Where did you get your information from? How did you get to where you at? How you gonna how you gonna show me something that you never did? See, I I don't have my CDL, and I could teach you how to run a six figure jobs without your CDL. How, bro? Oh, how, wait. Oh, let me guess. Go on the internet, bed, get, find yourself a cheap ass box truck. Go to go get go to Dun and Brad Street to get a the the MC number, a DOT number. Right, right. I I, I need to pay you that money to, to 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 for you to tell me that right. Out of here, man. That's that's the problem. You know, the problem is you guys is over here faking the funk. Y'all faking it until y'all make it. You gonna tell this dude, don't worry about it. You don't need a CDL. Just buy this, just go and buy you a truck and put somebody in it. But you're not telling him how hard to find somebody to put in your truck. Because let me break it down for you, bro. Hold on. You buy that truck. You put you you put the word out that you need a driver. You get said driver. That driver that you put in the truck already know what's up. Already know what his worth is. And if he's not getting paid his worth, then he's not going to give a fuck about your truck. Meaning that he could probably be on a motherfucking low right now and just drop your shit in the middle of a motherfucking 10 buck too. Now, now you got to find somebody with a CDL to go and get that truck. Now you got to pay extra for somebody to go and get that truck versus you already have your CDL, already prepared for the bullshit. So if somebody drop your fucking truck off, you can hop on an airplane Go down to where your fucking truck at, hop in that motherfucker and go. Nah, you got to take the time to find somebody to go and get your truck. And then you got to hope and pray and, and, and hope as well that that motherfucker will either bring your truck back.